they say that you are the average of the three people you spend most of your time with. I.e., if your best friend is Debbie f***ing Downer, you're probably not going to be as optimistic as, as you could be. If your friends are always out drinking, playing cornhole, and, um, you know, going to bars and get face and not being real motivated, then you're probably going to be closer to them than if you were hanging out with people that also own businesses that, you know, are entrepreneurs and are self-motivated. I've been fortunate in my life to have a really great group of people that aren't necessarily in business, um, but that have all been very understanding of me when I disappear for six months or, or eight months, nine months, ten months, whatever, to work on a new project, to open a new business, to, to do something for myself. Some of them have been my friend from when I had absolutely nothing, when I lost everything, um, and worked my way all the way back to where I am now. and. I thank God for those people, but if they weren't understanding of me disappearing for a few months, then, I mean, you gotta, you gotta know how to say goodbye to people in your life. And it sounds really cold, so it's not a popular opinion, but it's just the truth. You have to wisely pick the people that are around you. Just ask Trav.